Welcome to Dear Sheila, answering real questions with real solutions to help reboot your life. I have COVID credit. How do I rebuild my credit and get out of debt? Dear Sheila, I have been hit hard this year with medical expenses and my hours got cut due to the COVID pandemic. I'm having lots of trouble figuring out how to continue to pay all my creditors while maintaining enough income to get by. Last year, I also went through a very costly divorce and now this. So my credit and debt load were already maxed out. And that was when I was working full time. Now my hours have reduced to half. My question is, how do I avoid more credit issues, pay off my debt and survive right now? Or should I just file for bankruptcy? Signed, COVID Credit Sick. Dear COVID Credit Sick, this is definitely the year for rebooting and reinventing your business and financial life. Many people are also in your shoes and the good news is that most companies and creditors are more than willing to work with you and renegotiate your debt repayment terms. Let's run this situation through the Boots formula. Throughout life, one can find themselves facing difficult situations that often catch them by surprise. Over the years, I saw the pattern in all the times I've had to reboot and in how I've helped my friends and clients get through a hard time and quickly back into action. Ultimately, I came up with the Boots formula. The B in Boots is for being. It is about who you are being and all you are doing and who you need to be during this situation. You are going to have to be really honest about your current debt and how much money you must reserve for daily needs and a small emergency stash. Who must you be in order to face those bill collectors? And who are you going to be in order to show up differently going forward? This is going to make a huge difference. The first O in the Boots formula is for orientation. In order to get the outcomes you desire, you must be brutally honest here. What are you currently living on? What are your expenses, your debts, and how much do you need to put aside for other situations? What outcomes do you want for your finances? And what do you do for your current employer that you could possibly do as an independent contractor at this time? Do you want to reestablish credit fast and one day qualify for a new home or car? The outcome is to find happiness now while you continue to rebuild your credit and get out of debt. The next O in the Boots formula is for order of operations. Now that you know who you need to be and your orientation, you can decide in which order you must do things to set up a realistic budget based on your current income, stop all non-essential subscriptions and services, call creditors, renegotiate terms, see if you can outsource your skills for a new part-time job, decide what you can do to earn these extra income hours. See, in the long run, the order in which you do these things is really going to drive your results. The T in the Boots formula is for thinking. This is where your mindset comes in. Stop waiting to be happy when all the bills are paid off. Choose to live in a grateful and happy state now. Be proud of yourself for calling your creditors and renegotiating your terms. Somehow when you shift your thinking and focus on what you are grateful for and what you decide to move toward, the other pieces of life fall into place. The S in the Boots formula is for stepping up. This is the part that puts all the other pieces you have planned into place and gets you and your credit life back into action. The time is now for us to collectively work together to rebuild. My hope is that this video series and my new book, Bootstraps and Bra Straps, helps. In my book and on my website, I provide plenty of free resources for anyone dealing with a rock bottom situation to help them reinvent and reboot their business and personal life. If you have a question for Dear Sheila, message me at www.sheilamack.com. As always, I wish you life, love, laughter, and light.